In the past uh, years, I've been more and more interested in the topic of data and ethics. Uh, when I started thinking about it, I immediately thought uh, of the approach to design with dilemmas. Um, what is this approach? This is an approach developed in the Delft Institute of Positive Design by the PhD there, Oscar Amanli. And um, this is based on the assumption that people live dilemmas on a daily basis. What is a dilemma? Is uh, those situations in which we are obliged to choose between two options uh, and no, none of these options is completely satisfactory. So what does it mean? That the choice we take, it brings on one hand positive emotions but also a negative affection. Why I thought of this approach? My reflection is that in uh, modern society, the environments in which we live in are more and more complex and the systems in which we are involved are even more complex. All the technologies are ubiquitous and the environments are immersive and that brings uh, more and more opportunities for dilemma to arise actually. Um, many times in the field of privacy, we see that we have to make a choice. This choice cannot be between absolute connection or total disconnection because both uh, approaches have advantages. So how it is possible to get the advantages of connection and the advantages of disconnection in a everyday life, we have to make the user more aware and conscious of the choices he's making. the future developments in the field of artificial intelligence and robotics will arise more and more actual dilemmas uh, in the moment in which we will have to decide the extent of free will that we should give to machines. Um, therefore, the approach designed with dilemmas can be helpful to program machines in order to help users to solve their dilemmas or and not to create new ones.